Assalamualaikum. Welcome everyone to our lesson for today. Our lesson is for the third intermediate grade. Our subject, as you know, is the English language. For the second semester of this year, our lesson for today is Unit 1. We have pronunciation and conversation. From the book Super Goal 2, this presentation is prepared by Bushra Sebi. Thank you very much, teacher Bushra. And it will be presented to you by Sultan Shahrani. So, at first, I want to welcome all of you and I want to tell you that I'm really happy to be with you. And the second thing, of course, as usual, I want to make sure that are you ready to begin our lesson for today? Are you ready? You know, these are the objectives of, t of, uh, of today. In this lesson, we are going to Identify and pronounce the rising intonation in tag question. We talked about tag question, isn't it? Listen to a conversation to explain a misunderstanding. Okay, let's see. First, we have a warm-up. We have a face, and it says, help wanted. He wants our help. So, let's help him. Okay, can you read these clauses? Can you read these clauses? The first one. Can you read it? The first line. I want you to try. Take your time and try to read it. Okay, what about the second line? Okay, let's see. The first line is, I went walking yesterday afternoon while I was, oh, this is I was. Can you see it? I was walking. I stopped to pick, to pick. Can you see it? To pick flowers. Very nice. So now we are helping this face, this happy face. It says, I went walking yesterday afternoon. While I was walking, I stopped to pick flowers. Very nice. So can you see it? He's happy now for helping him. Excellent. Thank you very much. Let's see. We have now pronunciation. It's about rising intonation. Okay, let's see. You are coming with us, aren't you? So, I want you to listen to the voice at the end. At the end, the voice is going up. You are coming with us, aren't you? Aren't you? Okay, so the voice is going high, not low. No, it's going high. This is the high. Can you see it? Okay, we have four examples. Let's listen and see. Let's listen. Okay. Page six questions to confirm. Page six. Six. Pronunciation. Listen. Notice the rising intonation in tag questions to confirm information. Then practice. You're coming with us, aren't you? We haven't met before, have we? That isn't your car, is it? We were here yesterday, weren't we? So, those are tag questions. Can you see it? And we use tag question to make sure about th something, to make sure about some information. So, we are coming with us, aren't you? It's going up. At the end, okay? We haven't met before, have we? That isn't your car, is it? We were here yesterday, weren't we? So, with the tag questions, you have to go up 
at the end. You have to go high at the end. Very nice. This is the pronunciation. Okay, let's go to the conversation, the second part of our lesson for today. Okay, so we have a conversation between Ted, this is Ted, our friend Ted, and this is Sian, our friend, other, our other friend. We have an audio that we, will have, we have to listen to, so I want you to listen, and we will get back together. Page, page 7, 8, Conversation. You aren't from around here, are you? No, I'm not. How did you guess? Your accent? Of course. No, I'm from Ireland. Dublin, actually. My name's Ted Wilson. How do you do? I'm Sean O'Brien. So, what do you know about Ireland? Lots of Irish came over to the United States in the past, didn't they? Yes, they did. And you speak Gaelic? Yes. Some Irish people do. They like to hold on to the tradition. Is that so? So what are you doing in Chicago? I'm an exchange student. I'll be happy to show you around the campus. You're ending. What do you think Sean answers? Okay, this is the conversation. It was be between Ted and, as we said, Sean, okay? So, I want you to complete this conversation. For example, we have another conversation. It's between this man, the blue one, and the red. It says here, you aren't from around Riyadh, are you? This is that question. So, what do you think? What should you say? Okay, I'll give you an example. I'm from Jeddah. So I have to say, no, I'm not. You aren't from around Riyadh, are you? No, I'm not. I'm from Jeddah. So I want to ask him, this is question mark. So what, so what should I say? What about you? Or, and you? Okay, this is how can you make question and make the response to the question. Okay, very nice. We have a small exercise, beautiful exercise. Match each word with its meanings. So, we have the words here, and we have the meanings here. For example, the first one, number one, how do you do? How do you do? When we say, how do you do, what do we mean by that? What do you think? Which one? Hmm? Which one? Very nice. This one, the third one. So, let's write number one. This is number one. Okay. Let's put it here. Excellent. Okay. Number two. Is that so? Is that so? What do you think? Which one? Read them. Is it a way to offer to do something for someone? Act as a guide, a way to show surprise. Excellent, yes it is, a way to show surprise. Is that so? So you are surprised about that. Excellent, so this is number two. Beautiful. Let's continue. Number three, I'll be happy to... Okay. What do you think? I'll be happy to. So, is it a way to offer to do something for someone or act as a guide? Hmm, what do you think? Excellent, yes it is, the first one. A way to offer to do something for someone. For example, I'll be happy to help you. I'll be happy to read it for you. I'll be happy to play with you. Very nice. So, we said this is number three. Excellent. Okay, let's 
put it here. Okay. And the last one. Show someone around. Show someone around. Which one? Yes, it is. Excellent. Act as a guide. Act as a guide. This is number four. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Beautiful. Excellent. Let's go to the next. Those are the beautiful answers that you gave me. So, this is the end of our lesson for today. So, this is the summary. Okay. The first thing we talked about, rising intonation, such as in, he's a doctor, isn't he? So, at the end, it's rising, it's going up, it's going high. Is it? He is a doctor, isn't he? And we talked about conversation between Ted and Sion. The meanings of words, I'll be happy to, is that so, is that so, how do you do, show someone around. So we talked about the meanings of these words. And this is the end of our lesson. Really, I'm happy to be with you, and I hope I see you again. Goodbye, everyone.